about games that people play. What do you think about? hit my head a bunch and I hit it right here really hard so now I just this was on the bus uh, so I got to salvage this uh, it was blue I painted it black and now if I hit my head hopefully it'll protect it a little bit I wish it was a little longer but this is the only one they had on there so but it's it's right there so hopefully now I hit my head yesterday and I had this hat on so just imagine if I didn't have the hat on that would have hurt so I'm glad to get this installed I had to take this piece of wood off and screw it in from behind and you have to make sure the screws are the right length because you don't want to hit your head and have a screw go through your head either But anyway, one of the little details of bus life. Now I got some support. Put a different piece of wood here. I think it looks a little better. I got a piece of wood going this way. And then another piece of wood going that way. And I hold it in place and I put a piece of wood here so if I want to throw something in there it won't fall over out the side I'm thinking I may leave the bottom open for now it's secure it's not going anywhere and I can still get it out I need to. I don't know what you guys would save if you had to lose everything and then build a bus, but I saved my blender. I won that in a sales contest. Cause I was like a really good sales guy. I saved a few knives. Cause I like to fish and I like to cook. I saved a coffee cup and a couple of beer mugs and a hot sauce bottle. I also saved some pillows because I was at a garage sale and this lady was making handmade pillows and I thought they looked cool so I bought a few of them and I've kept these pillows for a while and I didn't want to let them go I think they look pretty cool they need to fluff up they were just in it like a vacuum bag so hopefully they they get back to life and I saved a few hats I got rid of a few hats. I saved some random stuff. I saved some scissors, uh, some measuring, 
spoons, a uh, bunch of random spoons, a bunch of random, well, a few random forks, one steak knife, uh, one cool looking fork, one nice big spoon, another cool looking spoon, and then a wooden spatula, whatever this is, a couple of, uh, I saved a couple of funnels, so I want to make hot sauce. The can opener, another wooden thing. Uh, this is for sushi. And then potato peeler. I saved this uh, silverware thing, but it's not working good. So I guess I'll have to fix that. Yeah. So, oh, and I saved this. Because this goes really good in hot sauce bottles. It's weird what you think about when you lose everything. What's most important? I saved some tambourines. Uh, my daughter Sarah painted this one. Sam used to use this one. I saved a few love chunk posters. Yeah, this is a poster we did. I think this is the first time Dave ever went swimming. And there, this is a cool poster. I got one, two, three, four posters. If anybody wants one of these, I'll sell them to you for like 300 bucks a piece. Because I need the money. I saved this uh, little blender, hand blender, which I think is cool for hot sauce. And I saved a picture. A couple other pictures. I'll probably throw these away. I don't know. It's just amazing when you have to move out so quick and then you unpack your stuff and you're like, what what was I thinking? Like I could have saved so many other things. But it is what it is. But I got this curtain right here for the window. This curtain's hung. Again with magnets. The magnet thing is working out good. Hanging the curtains with magnets, man. I mean What's wrong with that? You know? When you want your privacy, you pop them in. When you don't want them, you take them off and fold them up. I have to remember which, which window they go to, though. I might have to make it like a note or something. You know? I got this window framed in today. All right. Making progress. If I get this window framed in, then the only other thing I got to do is work on little nooks and crannies, get some carpet in here, and fix the front of the bus a little bit. I have a shelf here I'm going to hang that came with the bus. I'm going to go ahead and rehang that there uh, just because I need shelf space. And. I think that's about it. Other than plumbing, I gotta I gotta install my the plumbing underneath the bus, like my water tank. I gotta put a water tank down here to take the shower stuff, the gray water, and then I gotta put a tank on on underneath this side of the bus for fresh water. But yeah, things are good. Things are installed. Got the love chunk posters ready for anybody that wants to pay $300 for one of them. It's worth it. That's a cool picture. I mean, look. Who, who gets to swim under a surfer like that? Somebody's catching a wave, and then we're down below just making good music and doing our thing. Anyway, 
Yeah. Things are looking good. I'm going to be on the road soon. I like this idea because I got to have this, I got to utilize the space and I also need to get to the back from a circuit breaker back there and got this curtain hung today it'll be pretty nice because I'll be able to just slide it back when I'm cooking I can just slide it back Looks good. Looks good. Stoked. Once all this stuff gets cleaned up, we'll be jamming. We will be jamming. Yes. 